when I said that. I am Southern, for those of you who are unaware. So now we can get new X-ray ordnance, or high as it's known here apparently, which looks much better than X-ray ordnance, by the way. However, it's not. <laughs> you get 25 more rounds, 50 more damage, the same range, and it weighs 1,500 tons. It's really not good at all, like ever. We should do a poll here about people's home state. Some people are European, so I don't really have a state. We may as well research this just because it unlocks better stuff that I'll eventually probably use. And probably save the rest of this money. I mean, I could get EM Shield stuff, but not right now. I could get steering control, but not right now. There's no attack systems I care about. Unless we have reload. Nope. So we'll save that money. I'm from Florida, indeed. Or Flo Rida, if you want to pronounce it like that, which is a singer's name. A rapper's name, whatever. He's from Florida. In fact, I believe he's from the same town as I am. Same city, it's not really a town. Uh, do we need to do anything? Did I unlock anything I care to do anything with? I don't think so. Actually, let's check um, R&D real quick. You're born in Michigan and now live in Florida. Congratulations, it's hot here. So there's no more main cannons I can get. We'll just continue not using those cannons. You know... I don't really want to, but... Let's, let's get bigger guns. Why not? I can tell you why not, but whatever. We'll get bigger guns anyway. We have a single 80 centimeter gun, which I'm not gonna use. I will use this, though. So our damage goes up, reload goes up, rounds go down, dispersion goes up, range goes up, and weight goes up. I also don't fit, because they're freaking massive, but details. Needs to be there... In fact, I'm not sure if I can even... I can move that back, hold on. Let's put you there, let's move this one out of the way so we can get this set up somehow. You're in the way, move. There we go. That one's up. Can I get the other one? Thank you. That one, and that one doesn't fit. Hmm. In fact, we can't move that one back any further because the engine's in the way. Let's move the engine slightly. We're gonna be a little bit slower, but whatever. We'll have bigger guns! That way I can compensate for things or something. You miss snow. Aww. You thought Florida was one big retirement home? Um, it is one big retirement home. That doesn't mean there's not younger people there, it just means there's a lot of old people there. Because, you know, old people. It's what they do. They come here and then they forget how to drive and then that's it. They're done with their life, I guess. Why does that not fit? Because of this. Yes. There's somewhere I could put this where that'll still fit. Apparently right there. Whatever. <laughs> Somehow that fits on there. I'm not entirely sure how. And I'm actually going to swap this aircraft out because it's not doing me any good. I can't actually put anything on there, so I may as well just leave it. Never mind. So we can go 42 knots. But look at the cannons. They're large and inaccurate. And please do not speech speech Denmarkian in my chat. Don't even speak English because apparently I can't speak English. Let's go to battle! With five frames a second, because my poor PS2 is dying from overheating. 
Move the engines to the back and have eight layers of cannons at the front. I wouldn't be able to fit eight. And no. Because that doesn't actually really do much. I could put six at the front. Then I could fire six guns forward. But that's silly. Pew! That's going to hit the ceiling, isn't it? Uh, yep. Well, not all of it hit the ceiling. Look at that range. That's actually beyond the draw distance of the water. Good lord. I can speak English good, trust mine. Speechins. Hello! You're a battleship. I have lasers. You can hear them pew. I'm gonna shoot at you a bunch and hope it, hope it hits somewhere near you, I guess. It did, and it killed him. Well done. I'm right next to something, aren't I? Yep. Hello, Carrier Europa. Apparently they have Europe over here now. My god, they have the entirety of Europe on a single boat. I'm not sure that's how that works. I think I just shot a plane on accident. Please stop locking onto the planes with the 50 centimeter guns. Thank you. No farm, no farm. Not this mission. This mission's not best suited for that. Because of the boat layout and the planes that they have. They have really good planes on this mission. And in fact, for the rest of the missions, they have really good planes. They also have Apaches still, for whatever reason. But they start using... Uh, those, these XSBs, which are really good and not suitable for farming. Although, I will pick up these funds over here. This isn't Harvest Moon, this is Battleship Moon. For the love of God, somebody hit the stupid bombers. That is actually something I need to kill. So, let's turn this boat around because the kids are misbehaving. My boat just exploded because the kids are misbehaving. Also, my laser's out of ammunition. I should probably fix that. Probably also get rid of these guys. So I'm, oh my god, the helicopters. <laughs> I zoomed in and suddenly like 500 helicopters show up. Jeez. Oi! I'm almost dead. Sir, one ship is destroying our entire navy. What do we do? A few losses, you say? You j just a few losses, eh? I'm gonna need to repair... Oh, there's a 50% health right there, though. Can I make it? I think I can. These are eagles. Oi. No. Sir. Let's pick up that ammo for my laser beams. Actually, no. Because I need to go this way, like, now. So off we go. Actually, I need to head this way. Because a single boat spawned over here. And when a single boat spawns, it's usually a transport. Usually that transport contains treasure. Should be over here somewhere. Which means I need to murder its face. Because my machine guns shoot for eternity. Because machine guns. There's a missile coming. Oh, they got it. Right. I wonder how many funds are behind me. Oh, that's amazing. There's a fair number of Apaches behind me. I'm not entirely sure what they're doing, but oh, they have an they have anti-ship missiles. Of course they do. Me? Don't be an idiot. The boat should be over here. It's hiding from me. I know you live here, boat. I think he's behind this island. Yeah, he is. It's Penguin. Look at it go. Let's shoot it. A couple times, just to make sure. We hit it on the first one. Of course we did. 
It dropped a treasure because it's a penguin. Maybe time to get Sam's instead of machine guns? I've explained many times why I dislike using Sam's. I'll say it again, they shoot all of their ammunition at one plane. And then they run out of ammunition. And until I get a way to create ammunition on the fly, they're not that viable. I'm just gonna sit here and let the machine guns blow stuff up. That wasn't actually treasure, was it? Was it? Hmm. And there's like a million Apaches next to me now. Please shoot the Apaches. You know, we need pulse laser ammo. There we go. Apache no more! See? Lasers. I apparently just went live! Good to know, me! By me, I mean Lucas and Twitch emails. I'm not even sure I have to actually blow these up, do I? No. I'm just blowing them up for no reason. Screw your ports! No one likes ports. Let's stop blowing those up now. The machine guns do have slightly further range. Also, I'm being shot. Can you stop that, please? Thank you. And blow up that airbase, because it's being a douche. Although I could farm the airbase, but airbases are bad for that, because the planes die over land, and then they don't drop anything. And then it's no good. Look at the bullets coming off of this thing, man. See you, Lucas. Let's go blow up more boats. Because logic. Actually, what is that? No, not that. The boat. The boat! Damn it. It's a transport. Lock onto the bloody transport, please. No. Transport. It's a penguin. Blow up the penguin. We don't trust penguins. They carry stuff. I mean, I'll blow up these. Enemy transport ship is sunk. Enemy ship is sunk. Yay. 10986. What happened to 7? Were we counting? Yeah, fools! There's a full ammo that I want, but I want to pick up this loot first. Please stop this fight, you fools! Also, the main objective is now blow up more of them, because we hate them and stuff. Where is this? There it is. Oh, that's a single ship. Looks to be a couple over there. It is, in fact, a couple. Hooray, parts! These Apaches need to die, because... There's too many bloody Apaches shooting missiles at me. I do not approve of the quantity of missiles. Please cease your shenanigans. Southampton? We just passed by Southampton. No, seriously, there's too many freaking Apaches in this mission. They're probably all coming from right there, aren't they? Should probably blow that up while we're here. Yeah, they're all coming from that. Launches four of them at a time. It's a bit ridiculous. And they fly in formation, which is kind of cool. Did I miss the full ammo? Or did I get it? I don't know. I don't think I got it, so. Oh well. What about Northampton? No one cares about Northampton. Don't be silly. I didn't hit that airfield, did I? Nope. Where do they get all of these pilots, out of curiosity? Because that's a lot of pilots to just throw out here like that. There's Oh, there's another airfield launching Apaches or something, because their four just came from my left there. Or so, Yeah, some are coming from my left now. These freaking Apaches, man. I don't have time for you. I have other things to do. Like blow up these boats that are the opposite direction that I've been going. We should go do that. They have a cloning facility. I see you out there. No, I don't. There they are. Hello. Do you have carriers with you? You don't appear to. You do have Southampton with you, though. Ain't nobody got time for Apaches. 
There's definitely still an airfield over by those those ports I was in earlier. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna go straight for you with like a third of my health left, because logic. As the leader of the group just rams into the other boat, sounds legit. Formations go! That missed entirely? Whatever. This is why I auto lock onto everything. The rebellion has taken up arms! Hooray! Why am I destroying a thousand vessels? Because this is a game made by Koei. Well done, Captain! Oh, and Navi's crying, apparently. For some reasons. This is made by the company that makes Dynasty Warriors. Of course I'm blowing up a million boats. Also, they're surrendering? Nope. We're gonna blow them all up. We're not actually, I just wanted to finish blowing these up to see if they dropped anything. And to investigate the other fleets, which appear to just be normal fleets. I can't even see this one. There it is. There's two boats over there in that one. Battleship Sovetsky Soyuz. Why is there a Russian battleship over here? Is that Russian? I don't know. It seems it sounds Russian to me. It doesn't look very Russian. And lasers at ammo again. Funds! I would turn around and get him if I wasn't gonna blow up some battleships. They came in a pack of two, which is kind of discerning. Why are there only two of you? Are you like super strong and deadly? Nope! There's just two of you for no reason, apparently. You drop parts! I like parts. Do they drop both, both of them? No, just one of them dropped parts. There's also a bunch of crap over there in that far corner, but... There's no way I'm gonna go over there for that. So, we're done. Withdrawal! I'm nearly dead, but withdrawal. That'll be a reason, reason to withdraw, actually. A weason! I've turned, in, turned into Elmer Fudd, apparently. You don't need weasons to hunt for wabbits. You silly people. Hey, Rank. And a decent amount of funds. A guided particle gun, and two krypton lasers, and a plasma gun. That's quite the variety of things I can't use because I only have one of them. But we got stuff? That counts for something, right? Also, following the polar star, apparently. Because, you know, that's that's what you do when you're in a boat. Is Nagy dude or dudette? Nagy is dudette. She also has really weird eye shape, by the way. She has like alien eye, sa eye shape there. I'm still on the first, yeah. It's still first playthrough. That's de textbook definition of androgynous? Not quite. Also, I'm not sure that was pronounced properly. All you can see is her face, so... And because this is Japanese, there's not going to be a dramatic difference between a male and a female face. The main thing, by the way, to look out for in drawn faces from Japanese folks, this is generally how they do it, females tend to have a more pointy chin than males. Males tend to have either kind of a squared off chin or a, a, a fairly large chin. Yeah, Nagi has really bug eyes. I'm not sure what's up with her, but whatever. Like his chin, you can see it's, you know, his chin looks fairly normal. Next time you see her chin, though, she has a fairly, a, a, a more pointy chin. And that does tend to be a Japanese thing. They tend to draw the faces like that. R&D! Because everyone likes research and developments of high-tech weaponry. Like crit 
hooked on lasers, apparently, that weigh 2,000 tons and do 1,000 damage. It's not bad other than the fact that it, you know, weighs 2,000 tons, but we probably will actually be using those. In fact, I'm going to speed that up by one. Yeah, her eyes are just weird. I don't know. Her eyes are to make up for Skull's lack of eyes. He does have eyes, just like 95% of his pictures don't have them. And that's all we're going to spend money on. Those uh, Krypton lasers will probably replace those cannons. They might not, though. How long to the new battleship? That's a good question, actually. Let's investigate those. Eight turns to begin with, so it's probably in the region of four or so. Excuse me, sorry. Four. I win! <laughs> Where's my prize? I could speed it up all the way, actually. Not yet, though. I might do it uh, after this next mission here, speed that up. In the meantime, though, we will retreat to the north. Also, this is the second map you play in the game, repeated. Remember at the beginning of the game when I said keep note of the oil rig that Na Nagi points out? She does nag quite a lot, so she is Nagi. Random junk slash lag spikes, uh-oh. I did drop 60 frames, but other than that, we should be good. Remember the giant oil rig? There was a reason I told you to remember that rig. We can't actually see it because it's foggy, but it's over there. Trust me. Now, it tells us to go that way. Ignore it. Just go straight. What? It's the oil rig. It's not actually an oil rig. It has a giant laser beam on it. It also hurts a lot. Spoiler, giant laser beams hurt. We should be able to kill it, but this is probably one of the more interesting boss fights. There's also subs around it, but whatever. Fog clears up. There it is. It's massive. It is, that laser is bigger than the biggest ship you can get in the game, I'm fairly sure. And that's just the laser. Thankfully, we should have equal or similar range to its guns, so we can sit out here at max range to avoid being murdered, basically. It's not a moon, it's a battle station. Now it has four health bars plus the laser. It's actually, it's five health bars. Counting is fun. Each of the four columns plus the laser itself and it will do this. Which is basically just an energy collection system for the laser. Hooray! Oh, I forgot this thing had runways, too. Time to blow up more supports. Not the fuel tanks, the support, you dingus. You can blow up those uh, things, and it will keep the laser from firing so much, but... You're better off just shooting the thing itself and avoiding the giant laser of doom. Which is gonna shoot at me, so... Time to, uh... I'm actually shooting those accidentally, I think. Time to run away. I don't know how it's gonna shoot at me, though. Like that. Didn't run away at all. So what we're gonna do is repair. <laughs> don't mind me. Good. It almost killed me in one shot, by the way. It has a couple patterns that the laser will follow, and I've actually forgotten how to tell what the pattern is. I actually probably should have... And it's gonna hit me in the face. I probably should have the forward thrusters to actually avoid that. I should definitely repair, or I'm not gonna survive. I can't be repairing every time it shoots, though. That's a bit ridiculous. Why not get really close? That's actually what I'm trying to do. See, now it's doing the vertical sweep. 
I don't know what makes it shoot a specific way. Also, I'm fairly certain it can still shoot you at point blank, by the way. But we're gonna get really close anyway, and hope it doesn't kill me right now, because it's gonna try. Hi. It's gonna kill me. Eee, thank you for not killing me. <laughs> As it glitches out. I'm on fire, that's actually really bad. But yeah, we need to repair that or I'm gonna possibly explode and die. And it's gonna charge its laser and shoot me while I'm repairing, isn't it? Yep. Please don't hurt. Huggles? I bring Huggles. No. Save me. It's gonna come this way, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Of course it is! Why would I know how this thing operates? I don't. It has a gravity shield, by the way, if you haven't noticed. I think it may be based on the direction of travel when it locks. So, right there. So if I turn now, I don't think I can turn fast enough. I actually went under it. Alright, well, figured it out at the very end, but it's dead anyway. Hooray! It also fires a laser into space, because it's a laser, it's what it does. If you're a super weapon and it has a giant laser and you're gonna die, just fire it into space. We win! Otherwise <laughs> my guns are pointing straight up, because that's how they were when it ended. Silly guns. It takes your velocity while it charges? Enemy fortresses supporting structures. I don't think it takes your velocity. Oh, it kills that too. That's right. Auto kills everything. Hello, destroyers. Which have really no threat here at all, but whatever. That was all of the, um... Whoop, I'm stuck. That was all the solar panels falling, by the way, if you're curious what that sound was. They have a glass-breaking sound when they die. They are solar panels, after all. There's a lot of parts around here. Now, I have no way of getting it, but this mish this map does have, in the top left, an underwater base that has a treasure. So... Let's pick up all these parts, since they so kindly dropped them for us. Velocity does include direction, but it also includes speed, and it doesn't take the speed into account. So, therefore, it's not taking velocity in. What just spawned over here? Some random destroyers just spawned over here, apparently? Whatever. Saying it takes the velocity into account when firing the laser is only true if it takes the entirety of the velocity into account. Otherwise, you may as well just say it takes the direction into account. Speed does not equal velocity. You are in fact correct, although why you decided to point that out I have no idea. Because no one said speed was velocity. Speed is a portion of velocity. Why are they dropping so many parts? So that boat appears to be moving. That may in fact be the treasure up there. Who knows? Let's blow it up. In the meantime, let's blow this dude up for no raisins. Because raisins! Watch drop parts. Nope. Alright. Physics Joe 2. I took two years, technically three years of physics. Because I had to retake Physics 2 with calculus for engineers. Because Physics 2 itself wasn't hard enough, so they had to make it for engineers. These dudes are just going to follow me around the whole map. Because they're rude. It's what they do, stalk people. Time to build a submarine? Nope. I usually don't build a submarine until the second playthrough starts. The first submarine mission of the second playthrough. Airplane go? I could. It's not gonna kill him. It is garbage damage. Where's the boat at? Somewhere? Ooh. Assuming it is a boat? I thought it was moving. There it is. It's just a U-transport. I thought it was a penguin. May as well blow it up, though. Eventually, yeah. In fact, I should have already had anti-sub weapons on this thing, considering I have vertical-launch submarine missiles, but... 
you know, full ammo, don't care. I don't think there's much left at this 